I would say, okay, here are my three rugs. One, two, three. Sounds like a grouping game. Uh, six colors, F, O, P, T, W, and Y. And then it says um, exactly five will be used. So I just wrote a little five here to note that we're going to use the five of the six colors. Kind of sounds like an in-out game, but it's in relationship to the colors. And so this is a little bit, um, I guess what we could do here is we could actually create an out group. And so there has to be one color that's out, and then the remaining five will be in. Right mm -hmm. now it says um, each color that is will be used only once. Great rugs are either solid or multicolored. Uh, okay, so the rug can have more than one. Uh, because they're solid, we do know that each rug has to have at least one color. Um, so everyone has at least one, but they could have more. Um, any rug in which white is used, two other colors are used. Okay, so if you have white then you're going to have two other colors with it, right? So that group will ultimately have three. Caroline, question? OK. Then it says, any rug in which O is used, peach is also used. So if you have O, then you have peach, which the reverse is not necessarily true. If you have P, you don't necessarily have to have O. And uh, F and T are not used together in a rug. So F and T do not go together. Um, P and T do not go together, and P and Y do not go together. Okay, so P and T, and then P and Y do not go together. Now, um, we can actually combine these two rules with this one, right? If you have O, then you have to have P, but you can't have T and Y. So we could note that here. You can't have T, and you can't have Y um, with O. So this is a little side note here. Uh, whew, what else do we know? That's it. At least I can see. Anyone see anything else? I mean, one thing here is if you have white, right? White is going to be two, so then you'll have two more. So you have three total with white, which means if white goes anywhere, what's going to be true about the other two rugs? They have to be solid. They have to be solid, right? So it's it's white and then two solids is what's going to happen for the other rugs. I don't really have a way of representing that because we don't know where white goes. And it could be out for all we know, right? It could be the one that's not used. So which questions do we want to talk about? Yeah, yeah I guess there's one more inference that I made. OK, excellent. And that's that T can only go with what, white and yellow because if it went with olive, it would bring P in. And T can't, would go with P, and then it can't go with F. OK, or so we're P. combining these rules, the fact that O and P can't go with T and Y well, I, with. I guess the only options of things that T could be is it can be alone mm -hmm. with white or mm -hmm. with yellow. Mm -hmm. OK, so T can be alone uh, with white. Now, hold on. If it's with white, then it would have to be with yellow, right? Right. Yeah. So uh, it's either with uh, yellow or WTY, right? OK, excellent. Um, cool. Which questions do we want to do together? 14. 14. Um, if, there are exact, if there are exactly two solid rugs, then the colors of those two rugs cannot be. OK, so. We have two solid colors, one, two, three, one, um, which means uh, one of the rugs is going to have three, right? OK, so we go ahead and put three. Does that mean that it has to be white? No. Yes. I, don't, I thought it did in the game. It does say that white goes with three colors. But it doesn't have to. One thing is, if you don't know at this yeah. time, at this moment in time, just, just give up on the game. So, Robbie, I'm just kidding. No, in fact, I was just trying to liven it up. Not at all. Not at all. If you don't know, and I don't know right now, yeah. what could we do? Two. Yeah, just split. Like, just yeah. keep moving, right? Just say, okay, either white is in here or white is out. Yeah. Those are the only two options, right? Yeah. I mean, I do this all the time. 
Um, that was a rude thing to say. Uh, I, I didn't mean it at all. I didn't mean it by all, at all. Because I do this all the time. You know? Like, I do games all the time. It's my whole, like, life. You know? <laughs> but I still, like, in the moment, I'm like, I don't know. It's either, uh, yeah. I can't see. It doesn't matter. I just keep moving. Yeah. And just say, okay, so it's either this or this. And if it's, uh, can we go any further with either one of these? Well, if it is white, if you do have white, yep. you want, well, I assume that O would be in. Okay. If, if you want white and you want O, then it would have to be W, O, P. Okay, so if you want O, O could go out, right? Yeah. So you're right. We could have O, P here, and then what but would we have left? It wouldn't yeah. matter. Yeah. Because these things, if they're all single, so they can go wherever they want. Yeah. If you do put... Well, one thing we can't do is either it's OP or, yeah. or O is out, yeah, right? Exactly. Yeah. Now, I don't know if I'd create 3D. I mean, right. we might just be creating a whole lot of stuff here. But uh, it's either OP or O. So that's one thing we could know. Say so O is either in or out. And um, over here, since O is in, what do we know? It's got to be here, right? So this becomes OP. And then what can go here? We can't have T because of PT, right? You can't have Y because of PY. So, and we can't have W. Who's left? F. F. Now, can F go in there? Right? Right? I don't see why not. So we put F there, and then we have W out, so the remaining things are T and Y. So that's one scenario. Then we've got this other scenario over here. All right, so which of all, if... The, 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 then the colors of those two rugs cannot be. Um, well, one thing here is we know that they can't be. They can't be O, but they don't give us that. Yeah. If 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 we have O in, this is going to be O P. If we have O out. Um, we have to be careful about this stuff right here, right? So I think um, when I did this question, I actually took advantage of 13 somehow and thought that the problem would be with uh, P. I don't know why I thought that. I think maybe because OP would be nice to get rid of some of these problematic ones. But um, so let's take a look at these. How about F and P? Could we have, it would have to be this world, it would have to be FP, and then what would happen? Um, I don't know, it would work, so I don't know what would happen. So if you put F and P, yeah. uh, then you could have OP. O would have to go out, right? Because O requires P. Oh, yeah, that's right. O requires P. So O goes out, so you have FP, and then what do you have left? Yes, Y. And T. T, that's right. Yeah. And they don't they, they don't have any problems with each other. Yeah. So that works, that works. right? Okay, so the next one, F, Y. Um, go ahead and put that one there. <clears throat> I mean, okay, so we put F, Y, P. Now we can have O, P here and put T. Right. No problem. I, it's not saying that's what's going to happen. Yeah, I just say it's, it works, possibly. right? Yeah. Okay, so P, T. Um, now O is going to have to go out because we have P in. So we have PT, and then we have, what do we have left? F and Y, they don't have a problem with each other. Yeah. So that works. Uh, P and Y, what happens when we have P and Y? Well, O is going to have to go out, right? Yeah. And then what do we put here? T and F and T. F and T, and that's not going to work. Yeah. I guess I just got scared because I had to, I got somewhere there, and I was, I just thought I didn't make all the inferences because it turned into a, a witch question almost. You know, yeah. like you had to try it, you had to brute force it. Yeah, I don't remember why in the world. I think it was something about question 13 that I only tested C and D. For some reason I knew I had to do with Peach, but I can't remember why now. That's really helpful. Yeah, just, just hope that the voice speaks to you. <laughs> so it would be helpful. Maybe we should do 13. And then that will 
if one of the rugs is solid peach. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was 13. Because 13 had solid peach as one of the things, right? Yeah. And so somehow that made me think, oh, peach, when it's solid, forces things to happen. And so this is a problem. Well, one thing it does is it forces O to go out. Yeah. And so then you have O out, so then you have Y in, you're going to have to force right. some of these things. Whereas O is not really a, a problem necessarily, but these guys are, are problems, right? Yeah. And so then um, I tested uh, yeah. C and D. C and D. Okay. So 13 would help there. Yeah. Um, but yeah, that's a tough one. All right, so 15, 16, which ones do we want to talk about? 16. If one of the rugs is solid yellow, then any of the following could be true except any of the rugs is solid yellow. So one, two, three, we have our out group, and we have yellow as our solid color. Um, okay. Which one of the following could be true? So if yellow is solid, Now we've seen yellow solid up here. So one thing we could do is just kind of look at that. Does it have to be true that there is a, oh, could be true. Could it be true that there's exactly one rug? Ooh, uh, maybe. We didn't see it here, but maybe, right? Um, so we could just test that out. Uh, <clears throat> that would mean we'd have two in both. If we have two in both, what must be true? W's out. W's out. Right, so W would have to go out, and then we'd have to have two here. Um, o, P would have to be together, and then... F and T can't be together. Ooh, F and T can't be together. Um, and that's if there's exactly... Which, if the forest... That, so that could not be true, so that's out. B, white is not used in any of the rugs. Um, well, the question's asking except, right? Yeah, it's an except question. Oh, I'm looking so at 15. Oh, are we doing 16? Yeah. No. Oh, well that, hey. They both have the same answer choice A. Am I crazy? Right. There's exactly one solid rug. There's exactly one solid color rug. Hey, that's weird. They worded those differently. But they say the same thing. Okay, well I'm glad I made that mistake. <laughs> could discover a flaw in the LSAT. Um, which are following, okay, so it could be true except we're good. That's nice. This makes this question a lot easier. I thought we were on 15. We should have to start testing. But anyways, it's A is wrong for 15, too. Because <laughs> it can't be true. <laughs> I think that's strange, though. Do you guys think that's strange? They added a word in, in answer choice A. All right. Uh, other questions? No. Game four. Game four. Okay. Let's do it.